I'm here at Sony's launch of their new summer Vio range, and there's some pretty interesting models here, including the Vio Pro 13, which you can see here. Now, it's actually claimed to be the world's lightest touch Ultrabook. So it's actually, it's incredibly light if I pick it up. It only weighs 1.06 kilograms, which is about 30 grams lighter than a MacBook Air of the same screen size. Now this one here is the 13 inch. You will be able to get it in 11 inch, but only directly from Sony. So the 13 inch will be available in the stores. It's got a backlit keyboard that you can see here and also a carbon fiber chassis. It'll also give you around eight hours battery life with the built-in battery. You can buy an add-on to go with it if you want to. It'll be available with up to a Core i7 processor and that'll be Intel's latest fourth generation version. You'll also be able to get it with up to 512 gig solid straight drive. That obviously keeps it nice and light because there's no disk driving here. Now those specs are pretty much the same as the Duo 13 which is also launched here which you can see. Now this particular model builds on the previous Duo 11 which we saw previously. Now this Duo 13 only has a 9% larger footprint than the previous Duo 11 but you've got a much bigger screen, 30% bigger. The way they've done that is to reduce the bezel around the edge here. Now another difference that you've got compared to the Duo 11 is that they've added a trackpad which is really handy, you didn't have this before and obviously you've got a slightly larger keyboard as well making it easier to use if you're typing. Now it's the convertibleness of this one that's so great, you can convert it into a tablet. You've got an 8 megapixel camera on the back which you can see here and you've also got your stylus which you had before. Now previously you weren't able to store the pen anywhere, now they've put a little place for you to clip it in so whereas on the Duo 11 you had to carry it around in your pocket, you can now slot it into the side here which I can do fairly easily. Another thing about the pen is that when you remove it from the clip it'll automatically launch if you were in the sleep mode before so if I remove this we pop straight back in, you can put in your password and then get straight into whatever you were doing before nice and easily. Now there's also settings on this model and on the Pro which mean that when it is asleep it'll still take your emails in and things like that so it'll be fired up as soon as you open it up. Obviously you can turn those settings off if you want to. Now the previous Duo 11 was compatible with NFC, Near Field Communication, so you can automatically get your music streamed straight from the tablet, laptop, hybrid to your headphones or your wireless speaker dock but that has to be for particular Sony headphones and docks. That, that is also going to be available on the Pro and other models throughout the range that have been launched here so that includes also the Fit E and the Fit which are slightly cheaper models. Now talking of price this Duo 13 comes in at £1,300 whereas the Pro will be available for about £1,000 and that's with a Core i5 processor, obviously a higher processor, a higher price. Now if you want to find out more about these models and the Fitty, go to witch.co.uk. You can find out more about this fantastic offer by clicking the link in the description.